going to show you a powerful trading secret to make money with scalping. You'll absolutely fucking love it. First, we need the tool babypips.com. I'll leave it down in the description. We need the volatility tab, settings, day one, real time volatility per day is what we want to be focusing on now we need a chart euro us dollar four hour time frame we need to identify the market sentiment what the hell is it actually doing currently the market is dropping down there was a break towards the upside this is perfect this is what we want for profitable forex scalping day trading now with this tool we're going to look at the average volatility per day for the euro us dollar which is now currently 49.8 pips let's say 50 and we're going to use a measuring tool to measure the volatility for the day so bottom of the candlestick going towards the upside till around 50 pips now you want to give yourself some leeway so five pips is pretty good you know 45 pips 55 pips so expecting something to happen in around this area zone is all you can do so with our market trend identified and volatility zones marked we can actually do start trading and start looking to enter a trade i like to use the 15 minute time frame because it gives me more reliable forex signals when i'm scalping but we'll also check out the five minute trading because i know a lot of you trade the five minute so we'll do both so here's what we're gonna do on the 15 minute time frame we're looking for candlestick rejection so if we move the chart forward we do not care what happens over here right somewhere in the middle it hasn't reached the volatility yet we are looking some price action or interest in price action in this area zone only after it gives us a strong rejection on the 15 minute time frame like this then we can start looking to sell the trade off so the main candlesticks you're looking for are engulfing ones bearish bullish engulfing or a simple dodgy candlestick which signifies a reversal potentially you can enter straight away after the bearish engulfing candlestick or enter on the dodgy candlestick saving a few pips it really doesn't matter too much because the trade significance is minimal but if you like to save a few pips and make an extra bit of money that's something you want to be looking at now for the perfect trade entry we want to use the atr indicator the atr indicator is telling us 00063 63 6.3 pips and you want to double that so 6.3 times 2 is 12.6 so that should be your stop loss level so 12.6 126 on trading view as we can see our stop loss covers pretty much the highest point and our take profit level should be somewhere around here where the volatility is so around 45 pips volatility volatility reacted you expect the same amount of pips to drop in this case we are entering just over here so we are banking ourselves 32.8 pips which is 2.6 risk to reward ratio seems pretty damn good so after the initial beautiful trade the market has settled down and we could be looking for another trading opportunity since the market has now pulled back and dropped towards the downside even further so from 45 pips market volatility to around 57 pips we which means the market is currently oversold for the day, right? Euro USD is telling us 50 is the average. It can be a little bit more. It can be a little bit less. Currently sitting on 57 pips. We can do exactly the same thing for a buying trading scenario when day trading or scalping. So for example, if we wanted to scalp this trading opportunity, what we would do is go to the five minute time frame. So head over to the five minutes and wait for something to happen, right? We are currently oversold in this area zone. The volatility tool told us that right so we need some sort of candlestick confirmation nothing's guaranteed trends change all the time in forex so what we want to do is wait for a strong area of support zone where the volatility is exhausted if we can find one over here as we can see it starts to consolidate and can we get a bullish engulfing candlestick yes we can look at this beautiful price action if we just zoom in a little bit you can see a nice dodgy candlestick over here signifying there is going to be a reversal but that would probably probably enter on the bullish engulfing candlestick this is a great trading opportunity to buy so if we bought just over here we would look at the ATR indicator one more time so 41 this time so 41 times by 2 is 82 which means it's 8.2 pips so we can settle that just over here and the target profit would be again around the top over here but this time there is a slight problem for the trade and the problem is the day only has 24 hours so each day the volatility tool resets and the market starts moving again you know 50 pips upside downside you never know what we want to do is mark a zone on our chart where it shows the end of day so this 
over here once the candlesticks touch this zone is the end of day the volatility tool over here will start you know looking at Tuesday's volatility but you want to be aware of this because of spread difference if you're going to be overnight trading which you never want to do with scalping or day trading you're going to be losing a lot of profits so this is why it's important to market just to know that uh, this can happen and as we can see the candlesticks do go towards the upside pull back a little bit preferably I would close it maybe at around 8 p.m to 9 p.m so maybe somewhere around here because the spread difference is going to get bigger with each minute it's closer to the end of day right so somewhere over here you want to close it off so you risk eight pips and you would probably get eight pips again so that's fine potentially one to one risk to reward you close it off you don't want to worry about that so if you're not sure when the day will end head over to the daily time frame and it's going to have a little timer telling you when the daily candlestick closes that's going to be the end of day so mark that area zone and you're good i love this trading strategy for its simplicity and effectiveness it's great for beginner and advanced traders it's got a great track record for high success rate this method is actually one of the reasons i passed my fund the trading challenge and with a little tweak it can actually work for swing trading and long-term trading as well so if you want to enhance your trading skills or copy my trading signals i have a link down in the description below where you can join my group if not you might enjoy 20 pips a day trading strategy take care lions have a wonderful day stay safe and goodbye